My name is Becky Smith and I'm the co-owner of Mary Kate and Company. My name is Mary Kate Denton and I am co-owner of Mary Kate and Company. We are a full service hair salon and mini spa where we offer uh, aesthetic services and waxing. We would say our niche in the industry is our environment. Um, the environment that we offer not only our customers but also our um, team. Uh, it's something that is driven very strictly by our culture and our values. Um, I started in this industry 32 years ago, just out of high school. Um, I've been working behind the chair as a hairdresser for 32 years, along with um, coaching and leading a team to grow and um, become better people and better hairdressers. And about 12 years ago, first of all, I'm Mary Kate's sister. Um, I have always been a big fan of hers. She's been my hairstylist for many, many years. And about 12 years ago, I decided to hitch my wagon to her success. And uh, we decided to go into business together. Uh, prior to that, I was um, in corporate accounting. And um, I did that for about 10 years before I decided to go uh, along with Mary on this journey. What I've learned in 12 years is that there will be bad days. Um, but what I have to remember about those bad days is Every single time um, you go through a hardship or something, you will learn from it. And so, in essence, there are no bad days because we know that in the end, something great is gonna happen from even um, the hardship that we're going through at that moment. As an entrepreneur, you always <laughs> know you're taking a risk every, every day and um, you have a lot of fear in the beginning, but as you grow, and especially after 12 years of entrepreneurship together, we've just learned that um, the fears that we faced and the bad days that we've had have all led to good things and so we have less fear. The best days are when, um, because we put so much effort into our culture and our mission and our vision for the future, when the clientele and even the team really recognize that, when we have compliments from our guests where they say exactly what we want to hear without necessarily knowing that that was that was our goal all along they just put into words exactly what we have been trying to portray with our actions um, to add to that I would say um, another really great aspect a great day that we have is when we can see our team flourishing and improving in their own uh, personal and um, professional life it's just really a joy to see people grow we joined the Chamber of Commerce, I think mostly for brand recognition and community involvement, um, to be able to network more easily with the community. And um, we, we, we know we're a special place out, we, out on the west side and we just wanted more people to know about us. Uh, the education opportunities that the Chamber gives us are great as well. Yes. Mm -hmm. Honestly, economically, I would like to see Wichita grow. Um, not only from capitalizing on what we're already good at, but also uh, developing new industries, new innovations that bring people, especially our young people, and encourage them to stay. Yeah. I already have two children who've moved away because they felt that there was more opportunity elsewhere, so I'd love to see more opportunity and just um, continue to grow our dy dynamic culture that we have in Wichita. My nugget of wisdom uh, for the community is hit your wagon to people and organizations that you truly believe in and then work like crazy um, to accomplish great things together. <laughs> My nugget of wisdom is if you say you can't, you're right. <laughs>